Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hello world, I'm Chris Perillo, and this is the Locker Gnome Daily Report, or TLDR for short, your daily dose of tech news, gadget views, and other stuff you geeks can use. The Locker Gnome Daily Report is brought to you by GoToAssist from Citrix. GoToAssist makes it easy to control your IT world from one simple cloud-based platform, provide live or unattended support to any PC, Mac, or mobile device from anywhere, even from your iPad or Android device with the free remote support app. For a free 30-day trial, visit GoToAssist.com, click the Try It Free button, and use the promo code Perilla. Let's see who our top community and Gager is today. I'm firing up the free Locker Gnome app available for both iOS and Android platforms at this point in time. Yakub Kubaki. Congratulations. Thank you, everybody, by the way, for sharing these video links, commenting, leaving questions, and of course, rating them. Fusion generated electricity. Will it finally become a reality? I can't imagine that at some point in the future, we won't change how we're generating electricity. Although I am doing my part to conserve I mean, I keep the lights off in my home office when I don't need them on, even though it's bad for my eyes. So there you go. I'm sacrificing my own vision for the sake of the world. I'm going green. CDW data storage and virtualization solutions help keep data secure. Even if you're not in IT, let this serve as a reminder. Back up. When are electric cars a viable alternative? I drive a hybrid and I'm happy with a hybrid. In today's vlog, uh, I introduced you to one of my friends who happens to be driving a Leaf, a fully electric vehicle, although he did say he didn't drive it that day. You know why? Because he had a lot of things to do and wasn't sure where he'd be able to recharge it. So electric vehicles are kind of viable-ish. I mean, so long as you're really not going long distances or you know where you can plug in to charge up. Trust me, I am all about those electric vehicles. I am so happy that I don't have to pay as much as you might at the pump when we have to fill up. Passwords, soon to be replaced by eye movement tracking? I guess it makes sense and certainly that's more secure. I've used the face unlock on my Nexus 7 and it kind of works Sometimes I've done the whole pattern thing, but inevitably I, I forget the pattern that I set because I just don't use it frequently enough or on all devices. I just wish at some point we would not have to worry about passwords, that there was just an easier level of authentication that didn't require us to remember something and that would be completely, well, foolproof. Apple event roundup. What was the most important announcement yesterday? If you didn't catch my five videos that I uploaded yesterday on top of the live stream of the Apple announcements, uh, I, I seem to think that many people were impressed with the new iMac. Like even people who aren't a fan of the iPhone or the iPod touch or the iOS series of devices, uh, they looked at that iMac and thought, huh, that's pretty sexy. And it can run Windows or Linux. Or both. We posted our interpretation of the meaning of Lost, if you enjoyed that video series. Video series. Television series. Sorry, I look at everything these days as video. I don't care where I watch it. On a big screen, on a small screen, on a mid-sized screen. We also posted our CN160 LED light panel review. Uh, Ask the question, are self-driving cars a solution for dense traffic? If you'd even get into a self-driving car to begin with, and I would. Building a budget PC, the APU. Breaking it down for you, if you still are the type of person to want to build your own PC. Felix Baumgartner, pretty much the geek of the year, going to the edge of space and back, and really talking about how that was a rather momentous occasion that happened to be sponsored. Sponsors make the world go round. I love my sponsors, and you should love my sponsors too. Love them. Love them! Because without the sponsors, I would not be doing this. I'd be doing something else. Elsewhere from around the web, Microsoft has no plans for a second Windows 7 service pack. Guess they're really pushing you to 8 now. I hope you want to upgrade. If not, well, better luck next time. Cyber attack on Saudi oil firm disquiets US. Do you even know what disquiets mean? Square takes its first international step. Payment service now live in Canada. Google takes Street View Tech to the Grand Canyon. Thieves bug debit card pin pads in 63 Barnes & Noble stores. Today's question is sponsored by GoDaddy.com. Get three domains for $5.99 when you use the coupon code 599Chris when you check out. Looks like someone on YouTube has asked, do you think that Apple is going to cut into their big iPad sales now that they have the iPad mini? 
do we call it the big iPad or the regular iPad versus the iPad mini? Eh, who cares? You know, there's a smaller one, the iPad mini. Uh, here's the thing. And I, I kind of got this feeling yesterday after talking to Diana, she wants an iPad mini. And I asked her why. And she said, well, because I could slip it into my purse. And I was like, oh, well, no wonder a lot of guys don't want an iPad mini because they really don't have purses. The bottom line is Apple just wants you as a customer. Once you have one of their products, you might buy another and then another. They win. That being said, be sure to tune in tomorrow for the live feed as I unbox the Surface with Windows RT live here on YouTube. The video's already been scheduled. You should see the countdown. I bought it with my own money. No, not YouTube or the countdown. The Surface with Windows RT. Can't wait to do that uh, with you tomorrow. So please join us. And if you can't, we appreciate you just sharing this video or the links that we... We provided for you in the video's description, supporting our sponsors, rating the video, and then, of course, continuing to ask questions and leaving insightful, not insipid, comments. Do you know what insipid means? It's your word of the day. We'll see you later.